tried something I've never tried before. This is Hala. And I bought a spaghetti squash. I heard how good it is to replace in like using instead of using regular spaghetti. So I thought I'd give it a try. So here is my spaghetti squash. Okay, this is what it looks like. And uh, online it said to look for some that's, you know, fairly um, co uh, consistent in color and um, without many bruises. So this is actually half of my spaghetti squash because I've actually already cooked half. I wanted to kind of show you uh, the beginning as well as the end process. So, But what you're going to do is when you purchase your spaghetti squash, the first thing you do is you cut off the edge, the, the end here, okay? And I didn't do that because I wanted to be able to show you. So that's the first thing you do. Now remember, this is a whole spaghetti squash, okay? And you cut off that top end, okay? And the reason that you do that is so that your spaghetti squash can sit upright. Okay, now, there we go, okay? So, now the spaghetti squash sits on its own, okay? And then what I did is I cut my spaghetti squash in half, okay? And once I cut it in half, of course I had two halves. And this is one of my two halves, okay? So um, I have it halved there. And then what I did is I cut my spaghetti squash in fourths. So what I did is I cut this half into a fourth. So basically I had four pieces of spaghetti squash, okay? And what you need to do is you need to take a spoon and see there's seeds and they call this, I guess the seed any or whatever it's called, but you don't need this part here. So then what you do is you take your spoon and you remove the seeds and kind of all these loose pieces that's kind of part of the seeding, seedy thing. Um, and you, the part you don't want to eat, in other words. So you want to make it and so that you clean up all this center part. Because that's not going to be the part that you, you eat, okay? So once you get that all cleaned up, okay? Let's see, almost. Okay, there we go. That's pretty clean right there, okay? Then you take a microwave-safe container, okay? And I'm going to microwave it. And what I did is I took my microwave safe container and I put about an inch of water in the container. And then what I did is I placed my zucchini squash in the container faced with the rind up top with the let me see with the with the rind on the top right correct with the flesh part of it down okay? And then I put it but I wish I could, okay, there's water in here, that's why I'm trying not to spill. But, uh, oops, okay, how about if I do this? Uh, get rid of the water. <laughs> okay, there. So you place it in your bowl with um, an inch of water and with your rind up, okay? And you cook it for 12 minutes in the microwave on high, okay? And then your resultant product is, is this, okay? And what you do is you take your spoon, or take your fork, I'm sorry, I'm using a fork, and you can actually see how it actually breaks down like spaghetti. Oh, I mean, isn't this wonderful? I mean, just to think how healthy this is, okay? And now here is your spaghetti squash cooked. And at this point, you can... Uh, put sauce on it, you can put butter on it, you can put cheese. What I'm actually going to do with my spaghetti sauce is I bought a little bit of Alfredo sauce, okay? And then I also brought some frozen broccoli, okay? And I cooked my broccoli, okay? And I'm going to heat up my sauce. Okay, and I'm going to pour the broccoli on top of the spaghetti squash. Let me show you. This is what we're looking like here. I'm going to use a little bowl, okay? And here's the spaghetti squash in my bowl. Here is my 
broccoli on top and I'm going to pour a little bit of sauce on top. Of course, this would be heated, okay? <laughs> uh, but what I'm going to do is, gonna, for a show, I'm going to pour it on, and then actually I'm going to stick this in the microwave so it's all heated. <laughs> but anyways, here we go. We have healthy spaghetti squash, we have broccoli, okay? And we have Alfredo sauce. I mean, hey, cannot get better than this. Anyways, uh, be sure to try out a spaghetti squash. It wasn't difficult at all to prepare. Once again, you need your cutting board, uh, you need a very sharp knife, and you need a microwave safe container, okay? Bowl. And then what you first what you do is you take, you wash, okay, I'm not sure if I said, but you wash your squash. Actually what I did is I sprayed the squash with my little vinegar water mixture and rinsed it off. And then I cut off the end, okay, that, and that end that looks like this, okay, so that it, the squash can stand upright and make it easier to cut. I cut it first in half, and then I cut it in quarters. I cut that half in half. And then you set it inside your bowl with one inch of water, um, let it cook for 12 minutes, and you're good to go. Ready to put your tomato sauce, your alfredo sauce, your butter, whatever it may be, and it's really very good, very good. Give it a try. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to contact me, and be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel so you can get upcoming ideas and recipes. Take care. Bye.